I got myself a Canon Avalon Nano 3S right here. This is a new uh, lottery miner from Canon. It's pretty much a heater. So it mines at six terahash a second. It mines Bitcoin. And yeah, this is like the first hands-on unboxing with it. Let's open this up real quick. Never been opened, so it's gonna be first hands experience. Let's see. Okay, nice little Apple unboxing. So here we go, we got a black unit. There's a little display here with some, you know, little protector. That's pretty much a unit, pretty small. It's got, it's in the front. This is technically a, a crypto heater, so you could like make the air go up or down. It's supposed to like sit on your desk to warm you up. There's a USB-C port on the side here. There's a spot here for the Wi-Fi dongle that you'll plug in. And yeah, I mean, that's pretty much a unit. It's a nice little compact heater. So inside the instructions here, there's going to be a little dongle. Here it is. So what you do is you put in this Wi-Fi dongle. Oh, wrong way. So you put in the Wi-Fi dongle. And there's a power supply hidden at the bottom. It's 140 watts. So here is the power supply. There we go. And there's also a power cord. Hopefully it's a US one. Yes, so let's get rid of this. So yeah, power supply, pretty simple. Just plug it in. It's nice, transparent, translucent. Like the old days, everything needs to come like this. So let's just set it up without any guide. So we just plugged the USB-C cable in the back here. We'll use this extension cord. Here we go. And uh, I'm assuming it's going to turn on by itself. Yep. Okay, so the screen's lighting up up here. And yeah, I purposely didn't look how to set this up, so let's... Okay, hi. This is a very uh, Apple experience right now. Do I have to touch it? Let's see. Uh, please configure the Wi-Fi network. So we're going to have to download the Avalon Family app on our phone, it seems like. So... I got my phone. Is it gonna say something else? So I'm just gonna go into the App Store. App Store. Let's go Avalon. Avalon. What is this called? Avalon Family. So here it is. Let's just get. Let's open it up. So I've never used this. Let's allow the Bluetooth. Okay, we need to make a, do we actually need to sign up? No, okay, perfect. So we're gonna go to add device, turn on Bluetooth, blah, blah, blah. Yes, allow, search. It'll probably show up soon, there it is. Let's connect to it. A little slow, but you know. Bluetooth connection failed. Oh no, let's try this again. Okay, so it succeeded. The Wi Fi, we're going to use the IoT network that we have. I'm just going to put the password in. We don't need to show this. Very discreet. Yep, the password just him deploy. Not really. <laughs> uh, save. Yes. Okay, so now on here, it's it's changing now, so it's probably going to try to connect to the Wi-Fi. Okay, so it seems like it's set up, blah, blah, blah. Okay, so we got to set a new admin password. Okay, so now it's connected here in the app again. You can see at the top, HD IoT network. So the work mode is how, like, the, the Terra hash that's going to mine it. When it's at high, it's going to be 6 terahash a second. The other two options, I honestly don't know. But what we want to do is go to the settings and go into the pools. And we're just going to set up our mining pool. I have it on my computer already, so I'm just going to copy and paste the information. So you got the information from the IBTC? Yeah, that's the pool we're going to use. So then we save. Okay, our password, everyone knows it. It's here on deploy. I just said it before, so whatever. That's okay. It's going to restart. 
Okay, so this in theory should be the last step. So it is restarted on the device here. And eventually it should pop up in here, but it might take a little bit of time. So yeah, it's got a little nice high startup animation. It's pumping out heat. I feel it. So you could definitely feel it if it's on your desk. That's what's intended to be a desk heater. What do you think of the quality? It is. It's good quality. You'll probably yeah. do an ASMR video with that. Yeah, so it looks like it's good. Uh, I don't know if we'll actually just sit here and wait for the pool to connect. I mean, it's going to be kind of boring. Oh, here it is. So we can see down here, we have the Nano 3S popped up. And, you know, in a little bit of time, the hash rate is going to start popping up. So it is working. And yeah, that was pretty much the setup of the Canon Nano 3S. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> it's, I always forget the name of this.